Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for December 30th and 31st, Monday and Tuesday, for my lovely, lovely Cancers. How are you, my Cancers? Well, you know, Monday, Tuesday, I use my Radley Valentine Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy. But remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like, leave the rest. Okay, let's go on. I want to wish you all a, a happy new year. Um, we are leaving 2019 and the previous decade behind. I do feel, yes, I'm, I, that doesn't that feel good? Oh my gosh, yes. I do feel 2020 is going to be so much better, so much more of a positive energy for all of us. And I do feel that the decade will be, it'll be um, a brighter decade for us too. So, of course, we have life. Life always gets in the way, but um, I do feel I do feel we can be very we can feel we can go into it um, with hope. Okay, okay. So remember, I'm an intuitive channeler. So what that means is I open myself up to my higher power, spirit, and I just let whatever needs to come out, whatever their words are, um, come out, come out, no filter. Now, three cards face down. All three of your cards are reversed. And reversed is like a little more pay attention to me. So let's see for Monday and Tuesday. Now this, what, yeah, this could be more like let's wrap up the year. And it could be let's, this is what's going on for the next. But so let's see what we have. Three cards face down for my cancers. First card is the Ace of Fire. Fire energy is Leo. Sagittarius, Aries, passionate and burning. Ace is new start. This is a this is like oh my gosh, my cancers. <laughs> you know, if you have not done this, if you have not done this, put your intentions on the refrigerator. Okay, I'm not gonna say you're you know you're probably like me. You're not gonna necessarily do the vision board. In fact, I told my my Tauruses that they probably are the ones doing it. So. Hey, we want some friendly um, competition. Get that up. At least get your, I don't know why you needed to hear that. Um, at least get your intentions written down. Get what you, you know, put maybe two lists. You know, this is leaving, this is coming. And then what I would also say about the leaving is say, I, do, I release this, I do not need this, and I would burn it and put that out into the universe, okay? But the Ace of Fire, it passionate burning, well, burning, but not, but passionate, fiery type of energy. This is like, I am going to, I am finishing up this year because next year is going to be better. So, an exciting new opportunity, career advancement. So you could actually be hearing you know, you could, you could actually be reorganizing your life to start a new career. And I don't mean this, I don't really feel that this is a job. I do, again, I feel this passion, this passion in going forward into this future. Change your life now. Your next card, the star. Okay, so here we have Archangel Jophiel. Jophiel, the angel over creativity. But the star is, you know, the un you know, part of that is up in that universe. You know, isn't it amazing that in this huge universe, we're in this huge planet where there's so, so many people that, you know, that, you know, we don't think that we necessarily matter, and yet we do. We are part of this bigger piece, and we have to play our part. And I really feel that for you, my Cancers. You have to, that's again, you have to stay positive, you have to stay hopeful, okay? But you have to put your wishes up there. You have to do, you, you have to, so... So Monday and Tuesday, and again, I think that's going to be the thing. You have to do this. You have to. You have to write down what you want for this upcoming year, okay? Make it, and if it need, you know, make it big. Make it large. Make it, you know, make it those impossible things because miracles happen. I promise you, miracles do happen, okay? Now, I will say, okay, yes, Deb, sure, but, you know, divine timing is not always our timing, but I know that whenever things have happened in the divine time, it was the right time, at least for me. Okay? Okay. Happy times make positive, optimistic, long-term plans on the right path. You're moving along. It's on the right path. Your last card, the Ace of Water, your energy, along with um, Scorpio and Pisces. And this is fluid, emotional. So this is, again, 
this is again, you know, just being, you know, just saying, I want it, I want it, I want it, I want it. Put it down. Now, I will also tell you when you're doing your, your, um, you know, what you want, um, like, so if you say, I need to lose 20 pounds, put a date, okay? I want, I need to lose 20 pounds in, let's say, five pounds a month. So, you know, January, February, March, April, by April or by April 15th, you know, put some dates down there too, okay? Now, I will say to put some years in there too. I did it where I put the, the month and the date and I realized that it took maybe two to three years <laughs> before it got to where I wanted. It's like, but it got it by that date, that month and date. So put the year to, okay? I'll just tell you that. So falling in love or the resurgence of a relationship, spiritual growth and enhanced intuition, a new home. I feel lots and lots of positive movement for you, my cancers. I really, really, really do. And this Monday and Tuesday, I want you to know, crystallize crystallize what it is that you want coming up for your 2020, for your next decade, if you need to do that, and then put it somewhere that you can see it every day and you claim it every day. But in either way, Monday, Tuesday energy is going to be, it's going to be much, it's going to be much more positive. It's going to have a more positive um, feel to it. I feel that you have more energy. I feel you have more hope. You know, you, you've, been, you've been through so, so much. And each time, you know, each time you get stronger. And it's going to be, it's, it's going to start working. It's, it's, well, you were pulled off track. I feel like you were, you know, I'm seeing some trains on a track. And I feel like the train was derailed. And now it's like, the big, there's like this big universal hand putting you back on track. And, you know, now you do start from where you were derailed, but your train still starts moving forward. Okay? Okay. So Monday, Tuesday, please do what I'm asking you to do. Put it down, write it down, put it on the refrigerator, or put it somewhere that you can see. Okay? Okay. So, my cancers. If you enjoyed my reading, please remember to like, share, subscribe, and click on the bell. But my cancers, as always, besides wishing you a happy new year, a happy 2020, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.